Hello guys, welcome to the tutorial series of HSC ICT practicals. This is the second experiment, use of paragraph and heading tag in HTML. This is the theory. Okay. P tag is used to define paragraphs in HTML and to define heading, heading tags is used h1 h2 h3 h4 h5 and h6 there are six heading tags okay the equipment will be the same as the first experiment hardware a computer operating system application software sir notepad or any html editor and the browser should be google chrome Mozilla Firefox Internet Explorer or any of the browsers okay let's go to the procedure we will have to press the Windows button and search for notepad from all programs by clicking with mouse on notepad the program will start then we will have to write the HTML codes on this editor let's go to notepad okay i will not take your time by writing all of the codes now i have already written let's open it okay let's make it a little bigger Okay, this is the code for experiment 2. Let's run it. Okay. See, these are HTML tags for defining HTML documents, the body tag. Then we have written the P tag for writing this paragraph okay see this is the result of this line then the next line with h1 tag see this is the h1 the biggest heading of html and h2 this is the result of h2 it's a little smaller than the h1 respectively h6 is the smallest heading for html heading tags okay now let's save it as experiment 2 and we will have to use dot html and then save okay this already exists in my system that's why it is not saving again okay now let's go to the writing okay you will have to write the theory the equipment needed the procedure the storing procedure and the discussion means the HTML the description of these tags okay what does this P tag do the role of H1 tag defines the biggest heading like this okay then you will have to attach the screenshot of this two applications one for notepad the input and the output okay okay like this in the figure page of your practical notebook 
you will have to print the page and then cut those pictures with a scissor and then attach them with glue you do not need to draw it like the other subjects okay you will get the writing and the figure in the link below thanks for watching